Hey guys. So I've been thinking and I came to the realization that if you wear cute clothes to the gym, that'll motivate you to go to the gym. And I feel like it's true. If you dress your best, you feel your best. And when you feel your best, you feel like you can conquer anything, including going to the gym and just feeling good at the gym. So I don't know if that was like a reason for me to go shopping, but it was a reason for me to go shopping. So for today, I have a pretty big, huge haul video for you guys of some things that I got from Nike. Um, some things, including uh, two things that I got from Marshalls, uh, also athletic clothing related. So maybe I'll first preface by saying, um, if you know me and if my friends can attest to this, I have a lot of black and white and gray clothing in my wardrobe. During the shopping experience, I wanted to get items that were not black, white, or gray, and things that are more colorful, bold colors and patterns. That's what I was focusing on. Two, I wanted to focus on getting items that I can see myself not only wearing at the gym, but also wearing out casually, say like for a casual lunch or, or out running errands. I really like the fact that clothes can be multi-functional and you can use them for different purposes. That is um, another thing that I thought about while shopping within this past two weeks. Oh yeah, this is not uh, shopping that I did in one day. This is maybe like two weeks worth of shopping so that's why there's quite a bit so um, oh yeah and I'm wearing my Sounders jersey today one because it is our local Seattle soccer team and it's the athletic hall so why not wear a athletic clothing so I'll first start out with what I got from Marshalls I love Marshalls because it is pretty inexpensive and marked down from what uh, the regular price is and the first thing that I got was Okay, so this is one of two black or gray items that I bought, but uh, it's a dry fit shirt. I love how the front is a v-neck and it has this wonderful color blocking, like the one fourth the top is uh, black and the rest is gray. I think this looks like you can wear it out to the movies or you can wear it out to the gym, um, but it has that dry fit quality to it that I always look for in workout clothes. This regularly is $28, but I got it for $14.99. Marshall deals. The last thing that I got from Marshalls is this long sleeve, um, kind of like this uh, blush coral uh, shirt, uh, also dry fit. This is from the brand Layer 8. Again, I've never heard of this brand before, but going into fall season, uh, it's really important that I have some long sleeve shirts in the event that it gets uh, pretty cold outside. And um, I think this will work and it's pretty functional. Also, I can wear this out uh, pretty casually. This is normally $20, but I got it for $9.99. Okay, so now that we're done with all of the non-Nike items, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you all the things that I got from Nike. Also, disclaimer, I didn't buy my uh, Nike items directly from Nike Town Store because that is expensive. I got all these from the Nike Factory Outlet or the Nike Clearance Outlet. I think the difference between the two is the Nike Clearance Outlet is, um, there's fewer of those type of stores, but they offer the most discounts, I believe. For the first set of Nike clothes that I have to show you guys, they are all tank tops. And the first one that I have looks like this. It reminds me more of like a track and field um, top, if anything, but it has this navy blue uh, top and then this nice color blocking detail of this aqua color, aqua green color and there is a swoosh in the middle. The material is a little bit lighter, but it's still dry fit. This normally is $55, but I got it for a whopping $14.99, so pretty good deal. The next item that I have, the next three items actually, they're all tank tops still, but they are slightly more on the casual end, only because they are not dry fit, but they are cotton, but I feel like uh, with tank tops like this and the other two that I'm about to show you, I'm probably not going to be using this for any high intensity workouts where I'm going to be sweating a ton because I know that this is going to soak it up, but probably for something, you know, a little bit light. Um, first one that I got is this red and 
burgundy horizontal striped Nike shirt, Nike tank top, um, that is, and it has the Nike logo with the swoosh in uh, white in the center. The next two are kind of the same but a little bit different, just in different colors. You know when you find something that you like but you get it in multiple colors? That's what this is. The first one is a coral tank top with a white piping detail and the white uh, swoosh in the middle. And uh, again, this is also cotton. The second one that I have is a shamrock green color with a royal blue uh, piping and swoosh detail in the center. Again, something that I'd probably wear more on the casual side, but it can also wear this for any light workout type of thing, so got that. The next two are dry fit tank tops, and this one is a green tank top dry fit. Um, and the thing that I like about this Nike tank top is that the color is green. I find that I've purchased a whole bunch of green in this haul video, but it also has this kind of mesh quality to it. I don't know if you can see it from there, but uh, during hot days, I'm assuming that the mesh and the little um, openings uh, in that material would probably serve more as ventilation for your body so that it could, um, you know, have a little bit more air, I'm assuming. And the next item, also a tank top, but I was kind of freaking out when I saw it because I, I gravitated towards it because um, of the color and for the pattern. And for some weird reason, it was in the women's section, like this rack, but actually the whole rack was guy clothes, but it is this really awesome and rad um, neon yellowish greenish tank top uh, with these triangular patterns to it. That is sick. Like, I love the pattern. I think that pairing this with probably a black or gray, dark gray shorts would be really, really, really cool. Or even like having uh, some sort of colored shorts in the bottom just to do some neat color blocking would uh, be pretty cool. The color is amazing. I love it. And um, yeah, also dry fit as well. The next two items I am about to show you are dry fit shirts. So they have the sleeve to it with short sleeve. Um, and this one is the second of two black or gray items, but it is a dry fit crew neck t-shirt. Um, this one also has kind of an interesting pattern. There are horizontal black and light gray stripes. That's the pattern of the entire t-shirt. Uh, this is also from their Nike running line. It's a dry fit shirt and I thought this fit pretty nicely on me. And the last one that I got, it is a dry fit shirt as well. And the reason why I got this um, was because I have shoes that match this, the red and the neon green. Um, I can pair this with that and I think that was pretty perfect. But in the center it says freak with a, sort of a graphic quality to it. There's more like a, a smoke Kind of graphic detail over there in a, the lime green swoosh on the top right. Uh, it is a dry fit cotton tee. Not, uh, it's a, a little bit different than the other uh, material that's dry fit. This one has uh, cotton in it as well. That's that. The next category of uh, clothes that I have to show you guys are shorts. And if you're like me, I probably have black or gray or navy blue shorts, nothing else. So when I saw this next item, I had to get it. And they look like this. It's kind of like a um, interesting, smoky, I don't know, like a salmon with dark gray and blue and light gray pattern to it. I don't even know how to describe it. I just loved it when I saw it. It's dry fit, which is important, and I think you can actually pair this with any solid uh, dry fit shirt uh, when working out. I have probably, I, this is probably the most craziest shorts that I would probably wear in the gym, but I love it. And then the last shorts that I have, it's blue, but it's more of like a royal blue. The other blues that I have are like dark blue, navy blue, but this one is a little bit more saturated and a little bit more bright than the rest that I have. Uh, this also is dry fit, of course. I tend to go towards the seven inch seam uh, shorts because they go right above my knee. I don't really like working out in shorts that are below the knee because I feel like it hinders my mobility. Um, with these shorts, they are the perfect length and if I go to the gym, I don't want to carry all the stuff with me, so they have these um, in the back pockets, there's a zipper right here where you can place like a single key and maybe like your card if you're running, 
debit card, something like that. So, yeah. the next category of things that I have to show you guys are shoes. And to go along with the green theme of items that I purchased, I don't know how that happened, I got these Nike Dual Fusion Run Shoes. They are this, um, the sole has this light green and the shamrock green seen in these two shirts that I purchased. I don't know how that happened. And the top portion is this light gray color with the black swoosh. Um, and the laces are, are light green or lime green. So that was pretty fun. Small tip for you, I don't know. So I am normally a size eight in men's, but if you are the same size as me or smaller, go to the kids section. <laughs> I know it's kind of like, oh, but you're not a kid, save them for the kids. Um, if it's gonna fit me and it's probably $20 cheaper, I'm gonna buy it. So this particular shoe, although it might have a little bit of a difference in shape, maybe it's a little bit more boxier, I feel like when wearing them, they fit just fine for me. This is a 7 youth and I am a 8 men's. So, got this. This was normally $70, but I got them for about $32. And it's kids, so no shame. And the last pair of shoes that I got were these Nike Flex shoes. Don't worry guys, this is a men's eight. I really like them because I have black shoes and I wanted something that was a little bit more light. So a medium and a dark gray seemed to be a better option. I got the shoes with the red swoosh. I think I got these for about like $35 because if you go to the Nike factory store, I find that the, the shoes that are um, in like the clearance area, there are, it's an additional 20% off. So if you're there, definitely check that out. And the last thing that I got, I saw it and I really liked it, but I didn't know, I didn't really think that it would fit on me, like the type of style. But my best friend Crystal was like, look at that. And I, she made me try it on and I loved it. I'm not one, I have not really owned any camouflage clothing items ever but when I saw this like I liked it but I didn't think it would look good on me so she made me try it on and I loved it uh, it has like the, the the green and black and the dark brown camouflage pattern to it with a dark gray Nike logo in the center it's a sweatshirt material so it'd be perfect to run in during the colder months and I loved it. This is probably one of my more favorite items that I got. So yeah, that is my haul video. I hope you enjoyed this video. I got a whole bunch of stuff, so now I am really excited. I've been hoarding this for the past like week and a half, itching to use them, but I've been waiting for time to film a haul video. And after this, I am going to be styling in the gym. So if you have any questions, uh, leave it in the comment box below. Thank you so much for supporting me and watching my videos. Please like this video if you found this at all helpful or enjoyed it. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.